Hey yo, welcome back to this little put. Well, we're back with me, Hot Chalk, for another Battle Styles gameplay video and deck profile. And today, we've got the forgotten way to play Mewtwo. You know, we've seen Rillaboom popping off recently. We've seen Welder. We've even seen Victini as well. Oh, and Galaxy Mewtwo and all, them, all the all the other psychic variants as well. But this one's sort of fallen off the run a little bit. So how we bring it back? Because this variant has something that a lot or not a lot of them have, which is ability to Oko anything in format. Let's have a look. So, in case you don't know what Mewtwo and Mew does, essentially, it's a tag team Pokemon 270 HP with zero attacks that aren't GX anyway. But you have that perfection ability which lets you use the attacks of any GX or EX in play on your side or on the discard pile your side. So, essentially, we can just ditch all the stage twos that we don't want um, in the bin and we can just bench basics and away we go. So don't worry about don't worry about miraculous duo. We can't use it. So here's the idea. We're gonna load all our energies onto our Mewtwo and then use this Blastoise GX's attack. Uh, stage two Pokemon 240 HP. Uh, with the ability solid shell, this Pokemon takes 30 less damage from attacks. That's actually pretty beefy. It gives me an effective 270 on a two prize, and it makes me wonder if you could try and do like a standalone deck, Blastoise deck. Um then we have Rocket Splash, shuffle any amount of water energy from your Pokemon into your deck. This, this attack does 60 for each one you discard in this way. Unlimited damage caps. If you have 5 water energy and you choose to shuffle them back into your deck, you do a grand total of 6, 12, 180, 240, 300. See where we're going with this. Um, then you got Giant Geysers. Actually, uh, yeah, I have used it before. Attach any number of water energies from your hand to your Pokemon anywhere you like. So I can just let you just set up for a massive rocket splash. Worth noting, we can actually attack with this because we are pairing the Blastoise and Mewtwo's with another Blastoise. <laughs> this Blastoise is going to be our way of getting as energy acceleration to play because we need so many for rocket splash. This is how we're going to do it. This is the stage 2 Blastoise 160 HP with the powerful squall ability. Once you turn, you can look at the top six cards of your deck. Any water energies you can find, you can attach there uh, to your Pokemon. Absolutely nutty ability, you know, all things considered. This stacks, you can have two of these out and do this twice. The idea is. We get as many Blastoise uh, non-GX out as possible. Pile the energy onto our Mewtwo Mew. You can use Rocket Splash multiple times to take knockouts. Because Rocket Splash doesn't discard the energy. It puts them back into deck. So you can just keep re-looping. And as the deck gets thinned out of trainers and Pokemon, the odds of that powerful score getting more energy only increases. Also worth noting, we can attack with this Blastoise GX as itself, not have to use Mewtwo as a very solid two prize attacker, because obviously shares the same Evo lines. So we play a 4 1 4 2 line of the Blastoise, probably a bit too many of the non GX Blastoise, but when we play the stage twos, I don't like to skimp out on the stuff that gets stage twos out. <laughs> uh, we make use of a, of a Starmie GX, uh, mostly for its Star Stream attack. For one water energy, you can attach two energies from a uh, discard pile to uh, one of your Pokemon. And there's 40 damage. This is a very nice turn to attack if we're going second. Um, spinning attack does 3 for 100, don't worry about it. Hydra, I think I've used before, which for one energy does 40 plus 40 for each water energy attached to its Pokemon. So if you want to try and, you know, get a push for like a 2 co without having to discard all your energies off a Rocket Splash, then maybe Hydro Pump GX is the way to go. Pretty underwhelming, but it can get the job done. Uh, our only other attacker is a Blastoise and Piplup GX, a basic Pokemon 270 HP with a Splash Maker attack, 3 for 150. Uh, and you can attach up to three water energies from your hand to your Pokemon anyway. Like, if you do, heal 50 for each energy you attach. So, in theory, you could, this is like a soft G Max uh, Rapid Flow counter, because let's say they have 120 on the bench, Blastoise for whatever reason. You can Splash Maker, attach three down there, completely heal it. But what this is really good for is just piling on energies for your um, for your Rocket Splash, right? Because you can just, for three energy, and that's not too hard to get a powerful score, right? You can just get through a Junction Mew to Mew, Splash Maker, attach three more, and say, right, whatever I'm hitting into next will be KO'd. That's the idea. Stage two problems, though. Let's have a look, baby. Jeez. Okay. You know what? I'm not actually bad with this. Quick wall away, Blastoise. Get ourselves a Squirtle. Life is good. Excuse me. <laughs> um, wait, do we actually want to donate this whole hand away? Um, um, not sure. Uh, yeah, go on. I like to get out a second Squirtle if possible. Uh, which I mean, we do get, in all honesty, but I mean, I've got anything else for next turn. Um, mm, 
probably gonna have to crow about. So I think we're fine to hold this hand. Yeah, I'm fine with that, really. Here we go. Quick wall away switch. Just find Crowbat. Burn the communication. Get back Blastoise. Try and find Rare Candy. Good thing we got a switch in hand. We're going to the Dene. We don't want them carrying our Squirtle. For all intents and purposes. What are we playing against? Probably ADP. <clears throat> now, is it? Well, I mean, it is possible for us to blow this up next turn, right? Probably would have. Wow, this is a max rarity ADP as well. Where's your golden escape rope, bro? And your research. Come on now. How are you going to have all this and a hollow research? Come on. This is why I wish I started type. You can still chat to them. But like, how, how are you going to have all this madness? All this madness. <laughs> all that madness. And you have a hollow, really hollow research. Come on. <laughs> Does look nice, I don't know, let's be fair. <laughs> but if you have a demo account, right, I think you get four of a different lock. So I don't think you can actually go max rarity energy. No, I don't think you can. No. <laughs> so as it stands now, it doesn't look like they've got access to GX available. They would have done it already. So what are we doing here then, folks? What are we doing? Great catcher. I think that's doing us a favor, to be honest with you. I, mean, I want to attack with this anyway, right, at some point. Oh, okay, so they're still hunting then. I don't know why it took them so long to think about. See, any energy switch from them yet? No, okay. Okay. Okay, double quick. I think we're gonna what? Communicate. Blastoise away. Uh, take Blastoise back. This can find us a squirrel. Crowbat. Oh my god, we actually got a rare candy Blastoise. Well, that's madness. <laughs> we do powerful school now. It's okay, that's actually a KO. Nice. Now, is it worth getting a KO now? Uh, mm, is it worth taking a KO now? We have to try and blow up. Yeah, but let's, I think we do. Are we going to try and find a war turtle here? And that's a nope. We take the KO there, that's pretty nice. Turn two rocket flash for KO. Take two prize cards. Go on, give us a walk. Give us a rare candy, rare candy, rare candy, rare candy. Okay. <clears throat> God, if we can find double, double square, uh, double blastoise, I should say, and we can blow this up next turn, that would be immense. Uh, how many rare candies have we seen? Just a one. I mean. Believe in the heart of the cards in the top deck. Maybe start playing some Skyhead. Wow, they are detenaying. Trying to find some sources or something, are they? Well, it has to be. How many sources have they seen? Just the one. And they got the. the maybe they like half art supporters. It has to be. I think we do a great deal there. Oh. Okay, top deck and rare candy. We might have to like potentially mine ourselves. Um, well, we know we're putting three energy to the bottom as well, right? Yeah. Um, so you can take a guaranteed war turtle here, or we can risk it and try and get a <laughs> try and get a rare candy. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to try and risk it. I am a risk taker at the end of the day. Against my better judgment. Oh, close, close. 
Uh, okay. All right, let's see how much this powerful school gets. Three. Wow. I don't think that's a KO, though. That's a very good chunk, though. Six, twelve, eighty, two, forty. Yeah, one off. Right. Uh, so I think we still. Uh, yeah, rocket splash. One off. One off, boys and girls. I just haven't actually got an attacker for next turn, you know. Ah. The scary thing is that I didn't get a carry with this. And this looks like what they're going to try and do. Wow. Hold on a sec. All right, so now we boss carry this, right? Whoa, the money's stuck. <sighs> Six, twelve, one eighty, two forty. Is this happening? Is this actually happening? <laughs> For two rare candies. <clears throat> Yes! <laughs> we beat the sweatiest ADP player with max rarity, almost everything apart from supporters, with a stage two deck. Let's go! <laughs> okay, so here we go. Some Blastoise Beauty, a card where it'd be super cool if it were on a stage two, but it is so. <laughs> Let's call and fit to see what our opponent lets us do. They're going first. Got an all-dark deck box. Hate to say it could be an Eternatus. Uh, this hand would be five out of rare candy, innit? <laughs> uh, as it stands now, do we have access to potential star stream? Maybe. Okay, we here, single strike Urshifu. Um, normally, I'd be excited about, but... Okay, they don't even get one hound or down there. Okay, so double squirtle. Mm, I'm trying to think, what do we do here? We can bench them both. I can't like the idea of communicating. We'll communicate away one. That's gonna find Star me. Yeah. We then what? Quick ball or a Star me. That can find us. Maybe that squirtle back. Yeah. We'll bench that. We'll attach active, then we'll crow back. You try and get some energies in the bin now if possible. Oh wow, still no rare candies. We play into that um single strike squad now if we do go for the uh star stream. Um I don't want to research away two blastoise. Oh boy. Um I don't know what to do. Blast, guys, that isn't really terribly impactful. Got no energy in the bin, no point in star streaming. Oh, man, this is rough. Jeez. Oh, yeah, like a communication or something. We do play four blast choices now, though, right? We do get a Blastoise Black, but we still don't see no rare candy. <laughs> do we play them? Uh... I guess we do have to star stream, yeah. I mean, there's a fairly high chance that we don't actually um, get this Blastoise out next turn. Luckily, we're not under terrible amount of pressure, really. Like... <laughs> So let's see what our opponent does here. They research, get rid of a Mew and earn a Vitality. 
you know, they're committing to the back. They know that this active, um, active archer is not long for this world. <laughs> Get rid of boss. We'd like to see that. Second hound door, kind of impactful. We'll just play a final to Dene now if I had to guess, or Crowbar. Another single shot. Maybe that's gonna get communicated away. No. There's the Dene. Interesting they chose to bench another one. So they probably end up just using the scroll attack on us this turn. Decent little poke to be fair, yeah. What was that like a hundred? 110. Now we could actually get the KO here with Pip's Dice, right? But we're gonna have more we have to have more energy in our hand for that. Um heal 50. How much is, does the heal 50 actually do much? I'm not sure. But then we could start trying to set up this Mewtwo Mew. In fact, that's all alive, because we need to attach a third energy for that. So now I'm just chatting rubbish as per uh so we can take a KO with Blast Geyser. Have we actually got access to that? Nope. <laughs> Golly! Oh, I'll bench you. Wait, does it actually matter? What do we actually have access to as an attack here? Spinning attack, there's 200. Okay. Let's just play this just a deck then, right? And um Take that out of deck. Yeah, we're just spinning attack. But even with <laughs> stage twos, man. Stage twos. Probably get rubbish cards out the prizes here as well. That was a, you know what? <laughs> Let's reload that. That is a rare candy. We ain't seen one of those all game. <laughs> That's the reload you get when you play in stage twos. <laughs> oh my God, I found a rare candy. <laughs> oh, wow. That's what it's come to these days. <laughs> now, we got two battles, didn't we? Yeah. So we can. Well, Rare Candy evolved this one. And then we actually defaulted it, didn't we? We can actually afford to play some cards. I don't see a world where. Uh, it, could we get KO'd? If that went single strike charge, that went single strike charge. We could have got. And then we're out to attach a single strike for game for turn as well. So I've been attached. Single strike charge, single strike charge. One, uh, 60. Would have been a nice crisp KO to be fair, but then we do have this guy just chilling. So, provided our powerful school isn't completely like disastrous, we've only seen three energy. We've got ten in deck. Um, thirty-one card deck. I don't think it's terribly outrageous for us to like try and find some. Um, that being said, this is me. Okay, then. <laughs> there we go. Now we're back to our stage two hands. <laughs> you genuinely. Oh, my Lord. Oh, wow. <laughs> they want to put two red candy to the bottom of our deck. No. <laughs> Why do I do this to myself? Why do I do this to myself? I thought hey, this would be a fun, you know, this would be fun. This would be fun, right? We haven't got an attack we can use. Hydro pump. <laughs> Our opponent was like, how dare they have a rare candy? No, <laughs> stop that. <laughs> we can't even talk their communication in this scenario. They don't even attack. Reload it! <coughs> Reload it! <laughs> no, it's a riveting gameplay. Come on, go back. There we go. All right, so you rare candy this young fella. All right. Uh, we then what? Attach. 
I'm gonna do actually. I'm gonna touch active because I'm a big scaredy cat. Uh, probably Blastoise now, right? Two. Uh, six. Uh, well, so 120. Uh, so we'll put one there. Two there. Okay, let me money him back. We need to discard this young fellow. Oh, we got dinner. Hey, there we go. Oh, look at. Oh, my, oh, wait, 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 wait. And then if we communicate, we got actually. Oh, we can actually use the hydro pump GX. Well, hold on. So that'd be eight. What, 160, 240, 320. Wow. Okay. Well, we have to play this now. So I guess we have to find. I guess we could just take it back. We could just take it back and play it safe, right? Yeah, let's just play it safe. Yeah, yeah. There's a, there's a decent chance that we actually get into Blastoise on the back of this as well, right? Okay, no. So. We just. Um, no, there's Rocket Splash. So what? So is it six times? So 120, 240. Three, that's good. Or more. Wow. <laughs> That's not really very efficient, is it? <laughs> we get down to one prize card now, though. Um, <laughs> it's a rare candy, yo! To be prized. We, okay, to be fair, we did prize two rare candy. Let's get... We prized three rare candies. Oh, wow. Okay, so it's going to hop back. Our opponent just does an impact below for KO. So... <laughs> Funnily enough, we actually... Oh, we did have KO. Yeah, we just do Rocket Splash. Should we just see if we can... Oh, okay, they, they weren't going to let us. Uh, <laughs> if you have the more Battle Styles coverage and gameplay, I'll show you smash that subscribe button for me, okay? Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time.